Hi YouTube. Today I'm going to be telling you my anime origin story. I got this idea from Thomas Sanders. He didn't actually do the video. He just kind of said the phrase anime origin story and I was like, yes. Son, why do you do this to me? But yeah, my anime origin story, how I got into anime, what begun? This spiral of despair. Let's get into it. So, I have this book I made when I was quite young, probably like 14 or something, and it's Louise's anime manga list. But we won't need that right now, because my anime origin story does not start with anime at all. You need to learn the before to get the after. Let's go back all the way to like 2012. I'm guessing. I'm not actually sure if it was 2012 or not. That's just a guess. Um, this, I I would get really obsessed with shows. Like, I used to be really obsessed with Doctor Who before this, and I would get merchandise. I'd get all the magazines. You know, the Doctor Who magazines. I have a massive pile down there somewhere, in that abyss of black over there. It's just a pile of them. I don't ever read them, I just keep them because I can. Like, why not? Am I right? And yeah, um, the obsession kind of started with that. And then we move on to something that isn't actually an anime, but I feel like it had an anime inspired style. I don't really know. But let's start with Teen Titans! Watched that in April of a year, pretty sure it was 2012, 2013. Not actually sure, I don't remember the exact timeline because I never wrote down the date of when I first started watching anime. Kind of sad. Jesus, there's a lot. Anyway, um, it started with Teen Titans, became obsessed, was drawing it non stop, re watching it non stop, daydreaming about it non stop. Um, and then we moved to April of the year after that, and it was Avatar, The Last Airbender. Drawing it, rewatching it, daydreaming it, writing fanfiction. That's when I first got into fanfiction, when I first got into Avatar. But you can see the thing here, it was always April. So I'm guessing April of that year after that was when I first started to watch anime. That failed miserably, but look. I had a little code. It was if it was an anime or manga, if I completed it, if it was a movie or a live action, which I really love live actions now, it was a game RPG, basically like Mad Father, Ib, and Witch's House. I don't have Witch's House. What's the other one? Misao. The first anime I ever watched was Karen. Alright, you know, it's a bit weird. A lot of like sexual stuff. I didn't need to see at that age. But it happened. And then the list goes on from that. I'm pretty sure I watched Karen because it was on a YouTube video and it looked okay. <coughs> and then I researched it. I was like, oh, I might as well. So I watched the whole thing. And yeah, that started this massive list. But you see, the thing is, I was always keeping count because I wanted to know how many I'd ever watched, like, um, I've definitely watched over a hundred, that's all I know, I stopped counting them. But, I tell you what, I'm gonna count everything on this, this list, that's anime. <laughs> About 97. Obviously I've watched more, I just never wrote them down, you know, but still. Um, 
There's some pretty weird ones on here. And obviously I haven't actually finished the one where a lot of them I got bored of after like a few episodes. So I'm going to read you everything up until fairy tale because I would say fairy tale was the beginning of my massive obsession with anime. First off we had Karen, then I went into Angel Beats, Save Me Lollipop, Chaos Head, I finished Chaos Head? Oh yeah I remember that one. Tokyo Mimu, Inuyasha, The Melancholy, Melancholy, Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya, H2 Footprints in the Sand, Kamikaze Kaito Jun, Onigai Teacher, or Onigai Sensei, Pre-Tier, Orimo, Fancy Lala, Kimini Todoke, Full Moon wo Sagashite, One Piece, Sumete Lenyeu, Lovely Complex, Kaichuwa Midsama, Special A, and Fred. It's obviously more unless I'm in the second page, but. Fairy Tale was definitely the beginning of my life. <laughs> I still love Fairy Tale. I'm actually rewatching some arcs at the moment and I've just become obsessed again because I watched Fairy Tale Zero finally. But yeah. Ghosts are trying to kill me. And the sun has come back. Lovely jubbly. That was my anime origin story. These videos aren't getting any better, are they? I promise they'll get better in summer. Just got a lot going on right now and haven't had the best week ever. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this, don't forget to leave a like and uh, subscribe. The thumbs up I meant to say. And share with your friends because I need more people to like me because I feel sad and lonely. Leave your anime origin story in the description. Let other people know how you first got into anime. Leave some anime suggestions for people who want to know anime suggestions. And I shall see you guys in my next video, which will hopefully be a lot better than the past three I put out. Jenny! I'm fine. Can you hear my heartbeat? Tired of feeling never enough. I close my eyes and tell myself to mind.